Hey everyone, it's Kaylee Cat here. And in today's video, if you couldn't tell by the title, is a DIY cat toy. Um, if you did not know what a cat is, this is a cat. Really cute and just adorable. So yeah, this is Clover, my kitten. She's really nice, so she's trying to take the toy. You want it? <laughs> so, um, today we are going to be making a cat toy. I don't know if you've ever seen these before. If you have a cat, you probably, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. He's so naughty. So naughty. Mm. She's just the sweetest little thing. Uh -huh. So, basically today we're going to be making a cat toy. You've probably seen these before if you have a cat. It's just like a stick with like string or something attached to it and something at the bottom that the cats can chase around while you like hold it. So all you'll be needing for this DIY is a stick from outside or if you have a nice stick, whatever. It's just any stick, I got a random one outside. Some ribbon or string. I just have this orange ribbon. And any type of like ball or feather or anything you wanna put at the bottom. I just have this old cat toy that's kind of chewed up and broken but yeah I got it because I can easily tie the ribbon through the holes in it so yeah um so let's get right on into it to start sorry my cats are being really crazy <laughs> to start you're just gonna take your Sorry about that. My dog is a bit crazy. Teddy, come here. Stop. He made the phone fall. Sorry, guys. Um, so to start off, you're going to take the stick, and you're going to, if your ribbon is really long like mine, fold it in half, or if you have a shorter piece of ribbon, just take the ribbon and simply tie a knot with it to the top of the stick. Teddy, please stop. I can never film a video without having my dog mess it up. Okay, so I just tied a simple double knot like that. Hopefully it'll focus and hopefully the knot will stay. It's not really focusing. Eh. Is it focusing? Eh, good enough. Okay, I just have a double knot at the top. So once you've tied your double knot, you're simply going to take your toy and you can either, if it doesn't have holes in it like this one, you can simply just hot glue it. But if it does have holes, you're going to put it through any of the holes, see like, just like that. And you're going to make another, another double knot with the toy and the ribbon. Well, just the ribbon sort of, I don't know. Make a double knot, and that is all you have to do. This is the cat toy. It's really easy, simple, and your cats will love it. Now I'll show you my cats playing with it. So here's the toy. This is what you do with it. Kind of do this to annoy your cat. And eventually, if your cats are really playful, mine don't seem to be very playful right now. There we go. There you go, Clover. Come in. Get it. Get it, girl. Go like this, there we go, see? And then they just start eating it. And then, yeah, that's really it. My cats have reached an age where they're not extremely playful anymore. You can see Ginger's feet. She's under there. But yeah, my dog likes it. You like it, right, Teddy? <laughs> Come on, Clover. So yeah, she is really, she's kind of tired right now, so I don't think she's gonna play with it very much. But she loves these toys. She's just being weird right now. So yeah. You don't want it? You don't wanna play with it? You wanna play with it? Yes, you do. Oh well. Well, if your cats are really playful and enjoy toys like this, you should definitely try out this DIY. Thank you so much for watching, everyone. I hope you liked my DIY and use it. And yeah, make your cats a fun toy. 
Oh, there we go. You gonna eat it? You wanna eat it? <laughs> See, now she's playing. Now you're playing, aren't you? So guys, please like, subscribe, and comment. Put on the notifications bell if you want to see more videos like this and more DIYs. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please have a great day and keep smiling. Say bye, Clover. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>